Hi and welcome to Embedded World 2020 here in Nuremberg, Germany. My name is Patrick and today I'm going to show you one of our demo systems with the PicoCore MX-7 ULP. Here we have our module, the PicoCore MX-7 ULP. The PicoCore MX-7 ULP has mounted the CPU i.mx7 ULP from NXP. This CPU is well known for extremely low power modes. The iMix7 ULP consists of the Cortex A7. It will be used for high performance applications and there you have a Linux system. And on the other hand we have the Cortex M4. This will be used for example real-time applications and especially in this case for power management. The iMix7 ULP is well known for his power management. This CPU is the only CPU where you can set up the Cortex M4 as primary core and the Cortex A7 as a secondary core. All of the power management will be controlled by the Cortex M4. That means you are able to shut down the Cortex A7, you can bring it to suspend to RAM and the Cortex M4 is running and can some less power. So the Cortex M4 disable and shut down the different PLLs. There's a special design for it to save lots of energy. This is also the only CPU where the M4 core can be the master and the A7 core can be the secondary core. Normally you suspend to run the Cortex A7 so all of the register data and setup will be stored in the RAM. The RAM will shut down to the self-refresh mode and then only the Cortex M4 is running. The Cortex M4 has lots of power modes so you can just exactly go in different modes and have so lots of examples in which state you want to go. We have measured that if we also go in a deep sleep mode, set up the deep sleep mode for the Cortex M4 and also the Cortex A7, then the consumption of the board is 3 milliampere. So you can use a battery for power supply, then you have about 13 milliwatt. The target application for this board is a mobile or battery device because through the power consumption it's very very good. Now I will demonstrate it. You see in the upper our display with our application and the lower there are two buttons. If we are pressing the right button then the system goes down to the suspend mode. I will show you it on a display that the application doesn't quit, it just only stops and execute at the same position if we wake it up again. So I will suspend it now and show you it. The display goes off, the Cortex A7 is in standby mode, in suspend to RAM. Now I can wake up the system again if I press the wake up button and we see the application runs where it stops. I hope you enjoyed our low power demo system, I will see you next time.